okay, lift the gaze up, drop your head all the way back. Put the hands right above the shoulders, don't move them back. Put them straight in the right knee, inhale, keep the arms up. Turn to the other side, exhale, bend the left knee. A streak of electricity through your right leg. That knee does not bend. Inhale, push against my hand. Mm -hmm. So planted in that leg. Push against my hand. Yes, so strong. Hip square, tailbone. Mm -hmm. Shift your ribs to the left and then reach up one more time. Open the Vera 2, arms to the sides. Left knee pulls to the left, right hip to the right. And gaze is past the middle left finger. Still real strong in that back leg. Mm -hmm. Really into the legs. It's just key to having our back strong. Chest up. Mm -hmm. Chest up. Yes. Inhale, straighten the left knee. Turn to the other side. And exhale, bend the right knee. Right. So your tailbone is right under the top of your head. It's not toward your back heel or toward the pubic bone. That's good. Mm -hmm. Challenge the psoas by pulling your left hip more to the left. More. Keeping the right knee to the right. Last breath in. Mm -hmm. Exhale, the hands down. Step back, chana. Up dog. Open the front of your body as much as you can. And exhale, pull back. Boom, then you look through where you want to land and jump through the seat. Mm -hmm. Let's pull the flesh back and sit long. Watch your attention during transition. Just keep it real focused. It's one long meditation. Flex the feet. Lift the chest. Exaggerate the lift in your chest. Keep the heels down with the legs strong. And take a few breaths here. You've got this right angle. Send the energy lines in those two directions. Equal attention. Top of the head straight up. Sit bones are straight into the earth. Heels are straight out. So it's not so much muscular, it is interior energy. And then keep all of that length and inhale, reach up. Exhale, reach for the big toes with the first two fingers. Inhale, look up. And then exhale, lead with your chest here. Move across the leg line, and when you feel that first bit of resistance, just pause. There's nowhere you need to get to. There's no hurry. You're just guiding the two lines out to join. And they'll join less reluctantly if there's less force. 